744, just about 745 now. October, uh, Oktoberfest uh, celebrations have started all around the tri-state, and it's not hard to figure out what we're going to talk about right now, is it? <laughs> uh, this one has to do with the Liberty Home Association. They're Oktoberfest every year. Uh, Klaus Geis is here and, uh, and with, with friends. Klaus, first of all, tell me who you brought here today. Well, I brought Anita. She's our uh, secretary. I bought uh, Debbie. She's our uh, rental agent. And I bought uh, Ellery. He's a friend of mine. He also owns uh, uh, Banana Hammock Beer. And, okay. We're going to have him at uh, at our uh, event. All right. Now you brought four people. I thought when I looked at this spread that it took all four of you to bring this much food and that sort of thing. Uh, uh, what kind of what kind of food can people expect there? Okay. We uh, here starting at front. We have a uh, Mets and brats, and then we also have two specialty. Uh, uh, Sausages. We have the uh, spicy brine, which is a spicy uh, Cajun aduli, and then we have the uh, Bauernwurst, which is a smoked uh, met. Then we have uh, potato salad, sauerkraut, potato pancakes. We have the schnitzel, uh, which is breaded veal, and then we have the cabbage rolls, sauerkraut balls. This year we're introducing the uh, Geta Burger and Geta oh, Links. Okay. And I, you know, I, I'm looking at this, and it it, it all looks authentic. I, it it has to be. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. Most of it is. Yes. Okay. Now, uh, the the Liberty Home Association. Let's talk about the Liberty Home Association. Uh, the Oktoberfest is authentic because the Liberty Home Association is authentic. Yes. Uh, uh, we've been around for, well, next year will be our 100th year. Yeah. We were founded in 1917, and then we're also the oldest uh, uh, Oktoberfest in the Tri-State area. This is going to be our 51st uh, anniversary. Okay, and I get a chance to kick it all off, you know, and all that sort of thing. It's going to be great fun. Yes, great fun, and John's promised us great weather. Yeah, well, we, he promised. We're, we're gonna we're gonna hold him to that. That's right. Uh, you know, for people who go to some of the other Oktoberfests around town, what is, is it that you think distinguishes uh, uh, what uh, the Liberty Home Association's Oktoberfest is like? What does us, our uh, uh, niche is? Uh, it's a family-oriented type of atmosphere. Sure. We have a picnic grove. Uh, it, it's just more. It's not as commercialized, and it's just you know everybody likes uh, likes the, uh, the the friendliness and the uh, camaraderie, and just everybody just sits down and uh, you know it's like one big family. Yeah, I, both Sheila and Bob have uh, been the uh, burgermeisters before. They've uh, spoken of it quite highly. Mm -hmm. Said it's in a very nice place. What can you tell us about where the location is and the times and that sort of thing? Okay, uh, it starts uh, tomorrow, Friday, from six to eleven. It's Saturday from 2 to 11 and Sunday from uh, 1 to 10. We're also uh, our second anniversary of the car show this year. Oh, okay. Uh, and that's Sunday from 10 to 2. And we are located at 2361 Hamilton Cleves Road in Hamilton, which is uh, halfway between Ross and Hamilton. Okay. Now, in, in the instructions he gave me, he said that uh, when I get to the entrance of the park, it may not look like it, but just be patient. Go on up into the park, and it's all going to be good. But I'm looking forward to uh, 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 helping to kick things off on Saturday. Uh, it looks like it's going to be great fun. It certainly, it's going to have some great food. So uh, come and join us uh, for uh, what is going to be one of the, what is an authentic Oktoberfest. And, uh, and so 